Welcome back. So, yeah, we'll get to martial art later, okay? So, I, I shoot some kicks and that's it, okay? So, I'm just relaxing, okay? I'm, I don't want to walk too hard, alright? I take long breaks, okay? <laughs> I'm kind of lazy, okay? Yeah. We get to martial art later, okay? So, back in Madison, Wisconsin days, when I was in college, studying computer science, okay? I met a lot of great, fantastic martial, martial artists, right? I learned so many martial arts when I was in Madison, Wisconsin, when I was in Fort Hood, Texas, okay? All different parts of the Planet Earth, yeah, I learned great martial arts from all these people from everywhere, different races, okay. Mm -hmm. I met this Jeet Kune Do guy, okay, yeah, Jeet Kune Do, kind of Wing Chun, yeah, Bruce Lee, or Western Boxing. So, I met this guy in a bar. <sighs> He is very fantastic martial artist, okay, Jeet Kune Do, okay. Yeah, I also took this class, Jiu Jitsu class in Madison, Wisconsin, okay. The professor gave me a B, gentleman's B, okay. I don't know why, whatever. But he's a very good martial artist too, okay, so. Kind of slap on the hand. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So I met this Jikundo guy. He's a white guy, Caucasian, okay? Very handsome man, okay? I asked him, hey, show me your punch. Just punch in the air. Don't punch me. No, punch in the air. And he showed me his punch, and it was so fast. And very powerful, okay. I was like, whoa, <laughs> that's Chikundo Punch by this Caucasian American guy in Madison, Wisconsin, Midwest, okay. Well, I was impressed. And he asked me, hey man, show me your punch. Me? Yeah, you, yeah, I show you my punch, Chikundo style. I'm Caucasian American, Midwest, white guy, brunette hair. Show me your punch, man. You Asian man, okay? You are Asian. Oh yeah, Chikundo, yeah, this Wing Chun, Young Chun Kwan, this Forever Young, Forever Spring, okay? Eternal Spring. That's what Wing Chun means, okay? I know Chinese characters, okay? I'm Asian, so. Yeah, Asian boy, show you, show me your punch. Okay. And my punch wasn't that good. Okay, let's 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 do it. Okay, yeah. I mean, yeah, punching in there. Okay. Let's stand up. All right. Yeah. I'm not good at martial art, but I'm a student. Yeah, I mean, let's do, let's do some push-ups, okay? So, to strengthen our knuckles, okay? We do push-ups, okay? Like, how about this? All right. Let's be fancy, okay? Yeah, like this, okay? Uh. Uh. Yeah. So yeah, you can punch in the air, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. That's it, okay, so. Yeah. I'm aging, all right, so. 
cardio. I need to I need to take a deep breath. All right. Oh boy. <sighs> oh. <sighs> Show me your punch. Okay, yeah, it's punching in there, all right. Yeah, like this, like this, 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 this. Yeah, all different angles, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I can do, okay? So. It's about different target, right? Like, oh. Oh. Or oh, leopard style, right? It's not just like this, okay? Yeah, it's Chinese martial arts, it's all different angle. Uh, two hands. Oh! Leopard style. Oh! <coughs> or crane style, like this, like this, like this. Oh! Oh! <gasps> Leopard style. Alright, or oh, tiger style is like right? Tiger style like or ah! oh, crane style uh, snake style like Ooh Oh eh. yeah. yeah snake style like uh, like this like shh ah! right Okay, all right, that's my punch, okay, so. <laughs> I didn't do that at that time, okay, but since then I learned a lot of more martial arts styles, all different countries, okay. Since then I learned more, okay, so. but at the time, oh! Oh, show me your punch! I was like, ah, woo. I'm sorry, I'm drunk. I met this guy in a bar, okay? <laughs> woo. Woo. Hey, man. You gotta learn some more martial arts, okay? And I did! I heeded his advice. My Kung Fu is not that good, okay? So I learned and learned and learned. So my martial art today is diversified. I learned some Filipino, Muay Thai, Israelite, and Russian style. Yeah, I learned all that different martial arts from my friends. Okay, so I'm better now, all right? So Chinese friends, Tibetan, Buddhist, very esoteric, mysterious stuff. Okay. I learned all that stuff, okay? So, Koreans, Japanese, Chinese. Yeah, over the years, I'm 40, I'm 42 years old, okay? So I learned many good martial arts from my friends. Okay. So I'm better now, okay? So. My favorite martial art is Chinese Kung Fu, okay? Chinese Kung Fu is like solo dancing in African-American solo dancing style, okay? It's not partnership dancing, solo dancing, because I'm a single guy, okay? So, yeah, solo dancing, 
Chinese martial arts, kung fu, okay, is like dancing. You are not damaging any property. You are not hurting anybody. You don't need any partner to practice martial arts. It's Chinese kung fu, five animal form, right? Snake, leopard, tiger, dragon, and crane. Okay. I'm a huge fan of Chinese kung fu. President Trump, he doesn't understand. Okay, he doesn't practice martial art. Oh, kung fu! Yeah, China, China virus. Kung Flu! What does he know, right? But I love Chinese Kung Fu, okay? we we'll take five minutes, okay? Let's take a break. Yeah, I'm drunk, right? We can do some drunken style, drunken master, okay? Yeah, no, Chi Guan, okay? No problem. Chi means drunken, Guan means fist. Yeah, drunken fist, cheek one, drunken master. We can do that, okay? Give me five minutes, okay? Alright. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry I'm drunk, but we can do drunken style, okay? 
So when I was in Afghanistan, <clears throat> was year 2012, okay? I have my friends whose Kung Fu is better than mine, okay? Yeah, there's some, this Brazilian Jiu Jitsu guys and Filipino, this Arnie's guys and yeah, I learn from them because their Kung Fu is better than mine. They, they're true martial artist. Me, fake martial artist. Okay. I'm just a student. Okay. So they told me wonderful things. Okay. Yeah, they did. I learned some ground fighting like this Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Okay. So. And Filipino armies, okay, yeah, they go style. <laughs> yeah, I learned all that stuff, okay, it's in Afghanistan, of all places. I was in the US Army, okay, and then uh, I did learn some good martial arts from my comrades, my fellow US Army soldiers, all different races, mixed races, mixed martial arts. Filipino armies, okay. I I did learn, okay, yeah. Yeah. So I was in the US Army in Afghanistan, okay. So I would carry this Amazon.com nunchuck everywhere. I put it in my backpack, I mean my camel bag, because I love water, right? Yeah, <laughs> they took off on me. They took, hey, you have this camel bag. Is it filled with whiskey or vodka or what? Oh no, Sergeant, yeah, parent rest. Oh, it's just water. Yeah. They, they know, they're my friends, sergeants, officers, my colleagues, junior enlisted, okay. They know I'm a drinker, okay, so. Uh, let me get some whiskey, okay? Then I'm drinking. Yeah, I'm Asian male, adult. Of course I drink, okay? I have some dry red wine. Where's my wine? Let's go find wine, dry red wine. Okay. All right. Californian red wine, okay. Uh, Carlo Rossi, Carlo Rossi. Californian, Italian, American, red wine, dry red wine, Carlo Rossi, I'm a huge fan. Yeah. It goes down so smoothly. Okay. Somehow all these commerce, trade route, ships and airplanes. Californian, Italian, American, dry red wine, fun is his way to Alaska. It's so good. Carlo Rossi. Yeah. Okay, good. We'll do some rep weaponry, okay? Yeah, yeah, martial art, okay? i share with you what I know, okay? Yeah. So, I mean, my army friends, they made me this nunchuck, okay, wooden nunchuck, okay, but this is very hard, okay, yeah, shoestring, army boots, shoestring, some of my friends in US Army, okay, uh, they made this for me, okay, I carry it with me everywhere I go, okay, it's like treasure trove, okay, but sometimes when I do nunchucks, okay, I hit myself, yeah, Hardcore stuff, okay? Yeah, it was 
my from my friends in U.S. Army. Okay. Yeah. So I prefer using this form nunchuk from Amazon.com. Okay. So because it's training nunchuk. Okay. It's soft talk. <laughs> I'm not hardcore. I'm soft core. Okay. I'm not hardcore. I'm soft core. All right. Yeah. Because I'm a fake, right? Yeah, Nunchucks, yeah, Bruce Lee, he does this, right? Yeah, he does this, but yeah, we don't do that, okay? We, yeah, oh, Bruce, Mr. Bruce Lee is uh, just like, uh, front grip, frontal grip, okay? We don't do frontal grip, we do back grip, okay? Let's get back to basic. Okay? Yeah, baseball or samurai sword, like that frontal grip, okay? But we don't do that here. We are human allergies. We do back grip. We are like ninja, okay? Because frontal grip is like show off. Oh, whoa, oh, samurai, this Japanese samurai or baseball, this. We don't do that, okay? We are like ninja, also Japanese, okay? We hide our weapon by doing back grip. So, what do? You, how do you convert from frontal grip, show off, and back grip? Yeah, you hinge point fulcrum is your middle finger. Okay, I'm not flipping you any finger. Okay, it's just my heart. Okay, so give me a break. Okay, you open up your middle finger. Okay, frontal grip and back grip. Okay, ninja. Also, samurai. This is samurai ninja. They are both Japanese. Okay? Ninja is surreptitious. They hide their weapon. Like behind their back. Right? Ninja. Right? Samurai. Oh, show off. Samurai. Like baseball star. Oh, samurai. Baseball. Whatever. Yeah, but ninja, they hide their weapon. Tiger hiding its claws. Okay. Yeah, they prefer back grip. Okay. Yeah. My weapon is here. <laughs> I'm hiding it. That's more effective. Okay. I learned that martial philosophy from some Korean friends of mine. Okay. So. Okay. All right. I also learned some Tibetan Buddhist martial artists. Okay. It's fantastic, right there. Like, when I was in Madison, Wisconsin, okay, they will show me in our union break, fifteen minutes break, graveyard shift. Okay, yeah. Midnight supermarket store, right? Yeah, we went to back room. High ceiling warehouse, right? We took out this broomstick, right? In the grocery store. It was not Walmart, it was Madison, Wisconsin. Okay. Yeah. They will teach me all this wonderful esoteric Tibetan. Buddhist martial art. I learned all that good stuff. Tibetan martial art. Okay. God bless them. They are amazing. Okay. Tibetan martial artists. Okay. They taught me esoteric, secretive martial art style in Tibet. Right. I learned all that good stuff. Over the years. Yeah, yeah. Just rotating this rod, this broomstick on the finger, okay? Just like this, okay? Yeah, then you can do this like that. Woo! Behind your back. 
around your neck, above your head, right? Yeah. Just. And with your wrist, right? Yeah, I'm not good at it. But they did teach me, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's what I have to tell you, okay? So. All right. So uh, thank you. Okay. Let's wrap it up for today. Okay. I gotta have my breakfast. Chinese food that I bought. Microwave. Okay. So. All right. Maybe not. Okay. Yeah. Let's take five minutes break. Okay. And then we'll do some more. Okay. Maybe. Or maybe not. I don't know. Okay? We we'll take five minutes and we get back, okay? Yeah. Ugh. Yeah, I'm drunk. I'm at home. I'm not driving. I'm not going anywhere. No problem. American freedom, okay? We we'll take five minutes, okay? Okay, we are back. So every now and then my friends, dear friends and family members, they tell me, Oh, I saw you, you you YouTube video, you YouTube. Uh, yeah, you YouTube. You, you do all this massage, whatever. Yeah, but I saw you. I'm like, oh, this is my public private diary journal, public secret. How ironic. So when they mention this human art series, I'm like, oh, don't look at me. But thank you for watching. 
Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing because public secret, like me being nude, naked, public secret. Yeah, I'm kind of embarrassed a little bit. Okay, so. hey, thank you for watching Human Rights Series. Yeah, so God bless them. Hey, you make difference, okay? Human series, okay, I'm drunk, okay, intoxicated, but no, no problem, okay? I'm not driving anywhere, I'm not going anywhere, I just go to bed, sleep, okay? Yeah, I'm drunk, I drink alcohol, but no problem because it's just, I'm at home, okay? For my friends, my family members in South Korea, my friends in America, anywhere in the world. Maybe you are a random stranger, okay? Yeah. Welcome to humanology. Anything goes. Okay. So yeah, nunchaku. Yeah, the Japanese pronunciation, but it's Chinese martial weapon, okay? It's not Japanese, it's originally Chinese, okay? Mr. Bruce Lee, okay, he popularized this, okay, nunchucks, okay. It's farmer's scythe to harvest rice stalks, like, okay. But Chinese martial artists, they were inspired and they made this Three section nunchuk, okay. That's the original nunchuk in China. Okay. Later on, they yeah, three section nunchuk is too long, too big, okay. So they cut it down to two section nunchuk, okay. A very versatile weapon, okay. So but we don't do this frontal grip, okay. This is back grip, okay. So, okay. Because we are like ninja to hide our strength like tiger hiding his claw all right so if you do back grip okay oh. okay in human eyes called nunchaku nunchuk style okay it's more aesthetics fingering okay like Like magical trick. Okay. It's more f about filmmaking, framing, right? This like framing. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. All right. Let's wrap it up for today. Okay. I gotta get back to this sleep, eating, drinking. I have a political meeting I have to attend to, okay, so I gotta get sober, alright, so I cannot continue this. Oh, Chikon, drunken master, oh yeah, we'll do that, okay, now. Mr. Jackie Chan, right, so I was in Afghanistan, right, and did this wonderful Jiu-Jitsu master, my colleague, US Army in Afghanistan. He didn't have high opinion about Mr. Jackie Chan. Oh, he's an actor. He's not martial artist. Oh, I love Bruce Lee, Jelly, but Jackie Chan, he's just an actor. And I gave him some DVD, Mr. Jackie Chan, okay. Mr. Jackie Chan is an actor, but he's a fantastic martial artist. So I lent him some DVD of Mr. Jackie Chan, a lucky star, back in the days, like, police, right, police story, okay, and he was convinced, oh yeah, Mr. Jackie Chan, yeah, yeah, I thought he was an actor, but now I can tell he's a good martial artist, DVD movie, okay, 
Lucky Star Police Story, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Jackie Chan, fantastic martial artist. Okay. He's great, right? Yeah, Mr. Jelly, Bruce Lee, yeah, Daniel, yeah, they all look okay. Asian male. Very good martial artist, okay. So, me, I'm not. I'm not, I'm just fake. Imitator, emulator. Yeah, I'm drunk. Okay, let's do some drunken style. Mr. Jackie Chan style. Drunken master, okay. <laughs> he has this drunken master, his mentor, right? With his mustache and long hair, whatever. Okay. So Mr. Jackie Chan was learning from this drunken master. I watched them watch that movie before. Chinese martial art is not just a martial art, it's a philosophy and religion. Okay, It comes with a poem, poetry, very poetic literature. Right? Yeah, my body is a physics and metaphysics. Okay, My body is strong, but my mind, metaphysics, is clear as a silver mirror. Right? Let's do this. Chinese martial arts very philosophical and religious. Metaphysical. Okay, so yeah. Oh, my body is drunk, but my mind, my spirit is as clear as silver mirror. Yeah. Oh, I'm drunk. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No. Yes, human logical martial art, okay? Alright, thank you. Good night, bye. Have a nice day.